Hey Willaway, welcome back to our program design studio. I'm going to take you over a Tuesday session. We're going to start with a warm up. For the warm up, we want you to do three rounds of the following. It's going to be eight alternating step ups. So you're going to step up onto whichever surface you feel comfortable stepping on to try and find a ledge. If you have a box or a chair or a bench, any one of those is fine. We're going to go for eight alternating step ups. And you guys are going to do five burpees with a push up. We are going to show you the movements just now, but it's going to be a burpee. You're going to come out of the burpee then go for another push-up before you jump up um, that'll be one we'll do five of those okay from there we're gonna go for three normal inchworms no push-up at the bottom and then 15 air squats that should get you nice and warm to get you guys ready for a nice long gritty mental tester for today's session okay the workout is going to work like this you're gonna start by doing a minute of goblet step up so if you're using equipment you can hold your kettlebell dumbbell or ball in the goblet position otherwise you guys can grab an odd object so a bucket or any odd object that you can find you're going to hold it in this goblet uh, goblet position for step ups for the whole minute we're going to be alternating for that entire minute and you will rest for one minute uh, from there after that minute rest you start again and we're going to go goblet step up then one minute devil's press then one one minute rest and so on each round we're going to add one movement until you finish off the workout with five movements without resting at all in between. So that's going to be the workout for today. Your score is going to be your total reps completed. The 10 meter shuttle sprints, one 10 meter shuttle is one rep. Um, and that's our session for today. Let's, let's have a look at the movements quickly. The warm up is going to start with alternating step ups. We're using a cooler box, grab whatever you like, whichever feels comfortable for a warm up. After that, we're going to go into a burpee plus a push up. So, almost like a normal burpee, we go down. As you come up, you're going to go into a push up first and then jump up to complete the rep. From there, we're going to go into some inchworms. So, we're trying to loosen up the hamstrings for the ground to overhead as well as getting our shoulders nice and loose. And then the last movement that we are going to do is just going to be some normal air squats. Let's keep them perfect and make sure you're nice and warm. Moving on to the workout, punch your ticket. It's a new type of workout or a different style type of workout. The first movement you will do is a goblet step up. So the same as in the warm up, except we're adding a bit of weight. You can modify it to just do it without weight. Then we're going to go for some devil's press. We're using a dumbbell. You can use a D-ball, kettlebell, or an odd object. Nothing is going to change. It doesn't matter what piece of equipment you use. We're looking to get the same performance points as what OG is doing there. We're going to show you some ground to overhead. We're using a bag. You can use your piece of equipment. Once you're done over there, our last movement is going to be thrusters. So we're using a D-ball. Again, you can use your equipment or the odd object. It's entirely up to you. The one movement we didn't show you was our shuttle runs. Uh, we would like you to mark out 10 meters at a time, and I'm sure that you guys will be able to figure out how the shuttle runs work.